Hey guys, Tony Soy Sass Assassin. So here's a small video um, to kind of explain why we recommend you to wait, hold, and get a cigar uh, humidor that is more than three times what you need because they don't really hold that much cigar. So I'll, I'll just, just show you really quickly why I say that, all right? All right, so here is a 250. This is a uh, new air 250. But if you just look at it, like I put these things on here because when you pull out a tray, things falls over. Now I have four boxes here. These are 10 counts. So at best, this thing is uh, 40, maybe 50 cigars here, right? Just, just that. It's pretty much full. I put a little bit here, let's say 70. Twice that, it's only 140. It does not hold 250. Right? Unless you get bundle cigars. Just shove bundles in there, stack it up, no airflow. Yeah, you will hold that many, but it's not recommended, right? So this is the new 1500 that I got. As you can see, like if I just put trays here so that I can organize them uh, by thing, like, you know, this is probably 20 something cigars. Let's say this four trays is 100. Uh, the side probably hold half that, right? So it's probably two 200 cigars on one tray. You can't fit 1500 here. Especially the last tray is not even a full tray, right? So I have 20, 20, 25. Uh, so this probably holds 100 bundles. If you put boxes at all in here for any reason, you're not going to be able to fill this all the way to the top and expect airflow. There is no airflow if you fill all the way to the top. And you wouldn't want to just put bundles and, and single sticks in there. You know, you wouldn't be able to. So if you just look at these things, you put boxes and, you know, this is 10 count, this is uh, 20 count, this is, you know, you can probably fill 250 to 300 cigar if you fill all the way to the top. But even that, 300, 300, 250 or 300, that's only 900 cigars, right? Plus this tray, maybe a thousand. So you need three times what you need to really hold the amount that you're expecting. And uh, I hope that information really helps you. And that is really it. So make sure you don't get a cigar humidor that's too small for you. You want to get something like three times what you need. And don't start getting a humidor unless you have 500,000 cigars and to get something that fits you. Because a small humidor really doesn't do anything. You just ended up taking space using electricity. Make sure you get a big one. Get more than three times what you need. Even if you decided not to do that in the future, you can probably sell the humidor because it's big enough, right? So hopefully that helps you. I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.